Quilla, how are you? G'day. What's going on? And welcome into day seven of the 100 day challenge. So today we're going to just keep making money and get more people moved in and do some jobs for people and sort of set ourselves up to keep making money, having lots of food, to get lots of energy and doing some stuff. So let's rock into it. I think we should also probably go get some more traps today. That would be really good money. Theodore's not here, so I guess I'm just going to sell all these to John when he's finished it. He's doing whatever he's doing. Let me just get these stones out of the way. What I do want is some beehive and some honey, that'd be good. Do need another pick and another axe from him. Yeah, I'll get another pick and axe. That wall is still good for, everything else is still good. I'll take one of these. Use one of them. play much of the Dinkum uh, Quilla? Much of a Dinkum fan? Probably sell something. Practice my smelting. Five tin ore will give me two. Okay, let's do that as well. Actually, got five. <laughs> Easy. Yep. Yep. Uh, let's chat. Complete your quest. Here you go. That was a good trade. Let's sell all of this to John. That was absolutely miserable. <laughs> ah. Metal detecting for springs for more of that. We can do that. It's going to be an easy day today. Not so much. As in, like, new new to Dinkum? Or you haven't played much of it? Used to play much of it? Tell us your stories. Croc right there, I'm just trying to avoid him. Spring! Springs are good. Springs are what I want. Alright, I'm away from it now. Bright wires are good. Bright wires are always good. Keep our eyes out for the Ulysses butterfly. Good ones are in the water. Why? Why must you be in the water? 
I played since the first day. Ah, oh, excellent. I've ever been 300 hours and I uh, start this game over. Okay, right. Makes sense. Have you seen the uh, the new Flaming Winter update stuff? It's good. Recycling bin. Haven't seen one of those yet. Nice. nice. Really want some uh, beehive. I haven't found any for all the things I've cut down so far. All the trees. There we go. That's one easy. Peasy Japanesey. Devils has a volcano on her island. Nice. I kind of want to build one too. Now that we've got like lava as like the water beds. Springs will have four. Let's go for ten springs, and then we'll go watch the mangrove sticks, and then we'll um, go make some more traps. War crimes have been a, have been made. I didn't do it though. All right, I didn't do it. It wasn't on purpose. It just slipped. I didn't even want to do it. I just had to finish the job. You know, you couldn't can't leave them hurt. I leave them suffer. Trapping time, hell yeah. Chopping more trees down and starting to doing stuff on the board. Good. Ooh. I think it I think it is. I think it's the one. It is. Hell yeah. That's good.
Well, all these uh, waddle brews are back now, so that's good. That's what we wanted. Is that a fly? Yeah. And another fly? Might as well take them. Take them. They're free. Free ones are the best. It's fine. I didn't want it anyway. You know, no biggie. Is it me or the, it feels like there's like a peaceful wish on? Like things aren't wanting to attack me. It's just so weird. Or maybe there's a thing in the first month of Dinkum you don't get attacked so much. Maybe. Like easy mode activated or something. Okay. Sell, 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 sell. Yeah. Um. Put all this away. That. Food away, <clears throat> and then go do these trap, trap in time again. Okay, uh, um, let's have a look here. These are scarlets. I don't want them. Okay, uh, a craft joy. Okay, stupid question, but how can John's head be that white? He's walking around the sun every day. Yeesh. <laughs> well, you know, maybe he's uh, got like a lot of sunblack on. Maybe he's like really sun smart. Which makes it suspicious then, because he wouldn't be very Australian being that sun smart, right? Ain't no, but ain't no Australian that sun smart. But we're all tan. And always sunburn. Have high cancer rates. Oh, another butterfly. I think it's I think it's a good one. A couple of butterflies. Harlequin, hell yeah. Dragonfly. Alright. Uh, Rena, apologies, Dave. I need to go and get ready for my appointment. See you next time. Oh, thanks very much, Rena. Say bye to everyone for Rena in the chat. Lovely mod that we have here. Gives us a hard uh, time for free, which is always much, mucho appreciado. Easy. Like I've done it before or something. I really 
really wish I had my doggo cam on. You guys would laugh really hard at her. A little papa. Just being the little papa she is. I wonder, it seems like I don't have that many big congregations of uh, wary moves. What if I just do a lot more smaller ones? So I go make two or three more collection points and go around find the pairs and triplets of wary moves and just put them there. And then just like do it a morning routine of like walking around every area doing each one as I go. It wouldn't take long. If I don't have big groups, big clumps, and maybe I just do lots of smaller clumps, which would probably be easier. Ooh, yummy. Butterfly fat. I think it's the Let's go check it. Uh, no, it's a Scarlet. Nope, don't want it. Only want the good ones. I wonder, actually. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> Rather than running around, how about I let them come to me a little bit? And start planting some more wattle seeds back at base. Be easier. Could do it for crocos as well. There's not that many crocos congregated together. Waddle 2 is really good for like um, harvesting as well. Like if I want to harvest a whole bunch of trees or rocks or anything or mine, um, really good for that to help sort of speed that along. So definitely we'll get a lot more of these. It's also going to get the bottle brush eventually. Um, I'll back that way. I get more of that, then I can uh, have some help. Again, dump out. Um, tell the John before he finishes. And buy some more tools. Like I said, I was going. Yeah, yeah. Oh, good. Um, take all that. Yes. Next. Cool. Um, don't need any of that. Maybe a second furnace? And a second... Second everything? Just make everything a little faster. Yep, 
Time for the sign to go. Time for it to go. Uh, I heard from an Aussie friend that Waddle and Bottle Brush are really smelly. Is that true? Uh, no, not at all. They, when it comes into like, um, their flowering season, they, um, have a lot of, um, like, nectar on them, and they can be, like, really sticky at times. Probably the only true thing about them. Let's pick you up as well. Move you guys there. Wait. Plant some of these out this way. I don't think I'm really going to be using this area much for stuff. Do this way. The early days of Dinkle Mook should be all about you setting yourself up to getting, like, long-term survival, I guess. Like, setting up your orchard, having lots of, um, plants closer to you. Um, you can move the, the mud, too, if you really want. If you're lazy like me and you don't want to go running around to, uh, mangroves to get more mangrove sticks and stuff. Like, not needed, but just an easier thing to do. Um... Same with like a whole bunch of other things. You move it all closer to you to then be able to access it quicker and faster. There is, you know, the drawback of you having to um, sacrifice not being able to like harvest them for like a little while, but long time longevity, much better. Get rid of these trees. Um, what else do I have? Dailies. Chat the two residents, craft the new tool, do a job for someone. Alright, let's do this. Um, got a job for me? An apple. Okay. Do we like an apple? John. Yeah. How about let's let's talk. No, what's that? Okay, did that with John. So we'll get the apple and we'll come back. So all the way not to my orchard, it's not ready yet. I have to go all the way down to the southern part of the island. Yeah, we're going the right way. Evil. Um, they have pollen and they chuck old folk, uh, be a good chunk of folk can be allergic to as well. Listened as native plant allergy. I can't head or bottle brush either. Hey Evil, how are you? Luckily I don't have any of those problems of like, allergies. I don't think there's anything I'm allergic to. Which is good. Ooh, while we're down there, we might as well get some bottle brush too. Let's re let's do that. You know, this will turn into just getting an apple to bottle and bottle brush. Let's go. Set up that orchard for that. We're gonna have some more brews. And always collecting iron as we go past it. Need more iron always. <laughs> that was close. I almost hit on oh, no stamina. I want that to be buff for a bit. <laughs> There's a term for it as well. That sucks. I right. 
<clears throat> Has anyone else watched Cobra Kai? <coughs> I know I've probably asked this before in like another stream, but Cobra Kai, anyone? Nope. Uh, at least that's what um, was listed when I had an allergy test because I'm not sure if it's been updated and I'm old enough to have my own kids now. It's true. Ooh. That's what I want. The red stuff. I want some of that red stuff. I probably also want to get rid of um, that pin. I don't want that anymore. Apple? There we go. Found the apples, so while we're here, I might as well grab some more. Bottle brush and some more apples. And replant some apples. Another sort of like handy hint to think about as well is if you're going to be doing, um, if you want to like harvest all the trees around your area to, or like get all the fruits and stuff from and plant them near you, don't do the ones near your house. Um, because obviously you're gonna, they're gonna take a while to repropagate and come back and everything. So if you can go out a little further, cut down those trees, and then plant the seeds back, then at least while you're hanging around your area, um, you'll still have, um, those base ones from the start repropagating all the time for you. Just do a little bit of more extra legwork to go out further. But it will pay off later when you can, like, still waiting for them to grow and then you start your orchard still growing next to you and it's already done. Can you put crab pots in a flooded rice field or do they need a separate area? Um, don't know. Never tried. You know what? Actually, I don't think I've ever did the rice fields, not even on our normal island. Yeah. I really do that. I haven't played with that before. Let's go past it. Probably be a bad idea, but... I'm full of them. The Songski, welcome in. First time chatting. How are you? Can you put crab pots in a flood field? Okay. Yep, I asked that question. Sorry, I'm... the same chat on two different screens. One says first time chatters, one just says you're just chatting. <laughs> Give me one, or did I miss one? And he gave me one. Eventually, I'll also probably have to get these, uh, old telepads made up and done so I can travel around a little faster.
Okay, let's head back. Chat with Fletch. And give her an apple. And then craft one tool. And that will be it for today. Pretty simple stuff. what I really want. I really want a half back. That that would be good. Be pretty good right about now. I'm in Kentucky, US. First time I managed to catch you live. Oh, well, thanks very much for catching us live. Um unfortunately it's not gonna be a common thing to be streaming at this time. I just we had a public holiday a local public holiday here on Wednesday and I worked it so I've got today Friday off for me here in Australia. So yeah. But maybe we should start doing some more streams in the mornings on Saturdays, which would be like a Friday night for um, our fan base in the US. What do you guys think? Saturday morning streams, which would be Friday night for US. You guys down? Absolutely, says so Raymond Aura. <clears throat> right, got a spare one already. Always get metal when you go past it early game. Maggie says, sounds good to me. Sounds good. I'm usually up late Fridays. Is it late at the moment for you guys? I thought it would be like, sort of like, by now it's probably like, mid not midnight, but like, nine or eight at night. For you guys, maybe? Depending on where you are in the US, I guess, as well. There she is. She hasn't moved. She's still standing by the water. Yep. <laughs> 9,000 things. Ah, that's good. Alright. Um, what was it? Craft something? Craft a new tool. Um. Scythe?
over. That was about the break, but that's okay. Got like a million more of them. I bought way too many as I needed. Should last me one more, one more. Excellent. That's what I wanted. All I wanted. Um, put these away. It's 9.30 here on the East Coast. Okay. Good. It's not too late for some. And as always at the end of the night, we'll just quickly uh, do some uh, maintenance while it's late. We don't have to suffer too much penalties. Might just sell that shovel. Alright. No. I need it to break. I need it to break. <clears throat> what about licenses? You got any more licenses for me, Fletch? Um, no, she won't do anything. How much of the town debt do we have? 124,000. Alright, let's donate Max. Oh, oops. Donate Max. I'll get some more money in the morning from the wary moves. Speaking of which, let's try and make a couple of more of those. Um, collection points? So what do I need? Hardwood planks and stuff. Okay, so I've got two hardwood planks. Two nails. Arm. There should be enough to make two of them. Cool. Um, and now let's track some this. A second. That away. Um, mangrove sticks. Can only make one. Make one of that. And I'll just bring one of them. Alright. There were extra traps at that first place anyway, so I can just move them over in the morning. Um, Unpin that. And a little more stone will never hurt anyone. Anyone think that I actually know what I'm doing, hey? But if they think that, they're lying. They're lying to themselves. They don't know. They don't know that I don't know what I'm doing. Save the rest. Okay. Increase the number level of making bars. Excellent. Can't chat the Don, can I? He's probably going inside his house to. Another night is done, and we did a good success. I think it, I think it was a success. Let's lay down and sleep. Okay. So, um, day seven, we made a bit of an orchard of wattle and bottle brews we went and got a couple of missions done and made some more money we're going to expand our wary moo catching scheme and go from there um not too much more other than that uh we started also theodore's house so it should be building tomorrow and then the day after it'll be done so by end of day 10 we'll have two people moved in and we'll start be able to progress more from there and have other residents move in so 
If you have enjoyed this, make sure you hit the like button if you're watching on YouTube and subscribe, please, for more content. Uh, those of us watching on Twitch, thank you very much for your support. And if you want to give us a follow, it's totally free and it helps us out a lot. Uh, if you are watching the video um, that's in the future, the future, um, you can also then follow uh, us on Twitch and watch us live as we're doing it. By the time you're watching it, we're probably quite a few days in advance because these VODs will come out later. So make sure you follow us, catch us there. Everyone else, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye for now.